Guys. 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 I... I got... I gotta... I gotta get rid of some of this. It's... It's crazy. Look at the... Look at the madness. Look at the madness! Hey guys, it's Kay. Welcome back to my channel. Um, if you are new here, hello. My name is Kay. I'm a professional home organizer and singer here in the Boston area, and I'm here to inspire you to live a more organized life. And today, we are doing the semi-annual or biannual. I got issue. Do you have to with your motorcycle? Do you have to? Really? Semi-annual and biannual. Do they mean the same thing? Hey, it's Editing K, and I can say, before this video even starts, that semi-annual and biannual both mean twice a year. Biennial means once every two years. There it is. Anyway, I am here to do my twice a year beauty purge, beauty clean out, and today is special because I am especially frustrated and over it. I'm over it. You know, honestly, like, like, uh, in like 2013-ish, 2014-ish, I started really getting to like the, the YouTube beauty videos and the beauty communities and the Manny Amuways, the Laura Lees, the Tatis, the, the Jeffree Stars, the Jackie Inas, and I'm uh, kind of over it. Don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. Still love the makeups. Still loves the getting pretties in front of the mirror. Love the whole thing. Love this area. However, I am uh, uh, over it mostly. I'm over like I'm over like collecting it. I'm over it. I have so many things in here that I honestly don't use. Things that I've decluttered and then like snuck back in, put them back into my collection, which I'm very ashamed of. That I I really want to clear out some of that stuff today because uh, I I am probably going to be moving in the next. A few months so uh, spoiler alert that might be happening and I need to take as little as possible you know from one place to another so I would like to get rid of a bunch of stuff today and uh, let's have a real real chat about like uh, you know beauty obsession again I like the makeups I like the whole thing I like doing the ma I have makeup on today I don't know if you can tell it's still fun I still have a great time getting all dolled up and everything and I need makeup for the stage and all that stuff. But however, I have so much that I cannot use at all and some of it's probably going bad and I need to just get it out the door. So we're gonna go through and we're gonna be brutal today. We're gonna make it happen. Clover, come here. I'm not moving the camera, but I'm shooting this on my iPhone. Clover has brought this toy in to me because he has not had enough playtime today. Clover, uh, this is my dog Clover, if you guys don't know him. He wants to play all the time, every day, all day. Do you want to play? I will play after I'm done, okay? We gotta declutter first. Yeah, but you're very cute though. Awfully cute and handsome. Very cute. So if you've never seen me before, this is my beauty area, and I love it. It's really fun. I like to get ready here. It's a good time. I got, this is my clean uh, brushes, and that's the rest of my clean brushes, and up here, in these two things, I've got dirty brushes, so you can tell that I haven't really been cleaning these, like, in the last few weeks. I don't like it. But I think in order to make this easier, I'm going to start in the drawers down here. There's some drawers, so let's start here and get rid of some stuff because I'm over it! Okay, now my first issue is, like, this first drawer. This first drawer has like all of the stuff that I'm like, I wanna use, but I, I don't because it's in the store. Dumb. All right, we've zoomed in here, so I'm just gonna start taking things out. Pat McGrath, we're keeping Pat McGrath. I mean, come on. I, I, I do hate this packaging though, but the palette's really cool. So we're gonna keep that. Uh, I like that, I actually use this palette. So we're gonna keep that. This I got this on a BoxyCharm, and I have to, I'd really have to say, <clears throat> after this video is over, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cancel BoxyCharm because I'm over it. Keeping this. See, this is all the stuff I wanna use. Ooh, butter line. I got this in a BoxyCharm. I think I used it like once. But the, I mean, I, no, you get out. Okay, this Tarte palette, I, I mean, come on. I have one exactly like it. Gone. This one I've used. <laughs> this one I've, okay, I'm gonna hold on to that one. That one I've used, that one I like. Okay. Steal a palette, we all know about that. I love this thing. This is great. It's great for traveling. Really good. 
Good times. These guys. Okay. Here's where I get into trouble. I have sentimental attachment to these because I like took these to Paris for my honeymoon. But have I used these in the past few months? No. So you know what? Out, out of here. Winky Lux, we've used her. Uh, I've used this. So I like this. It's cute. I'm annoyed that it doesn't have a mirror though. Okay. <laughs> this is this stupid Z palette uh, that I, you know what? I don't use any of these pans in here. I want to put things in here that I use. So you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna take the pans out and we're gonna get rid of them. Okay, I put them in some paper because truly I want to be able to use this. I want to like depot, depot. <laughs> what is what is what do I mean? Anyway, I want to put some separate things in here so that I can use them. So we'll put that aside. Here's another Z palette that I haven't touched. You know what? I actually went through the trouble of like taking these things out of their uh, palettes and putting them in here and then not using them which is annoying, so goodbye. Honestly, such a mess. This is the only one I bother with ever. This is like something from like a Too Faced palette back in the day, so maybe we'll just stick her right there. Look, it fits perfectly. <laughs> of course it does, it's a 90 degree angle. I'm, I'm silly. Hourglass! I've used this, <laughs> so I'm gonna hold on to that. Okay, finally, you know what, I've, I think I've gotten rid of this in a palette declutter before, but you know what, I put it back. Uh, why? I don't know. I'm gonna, put, I'm gonna get rid of it finally for this time for good. Seriously, I, you won't see the next declutter. If you do, you can, I don't know what you can do. Uh, this steel a thing, I've used this, but I, I didn't know it was in here, so let's bring that out. Tarte Lit in Bloom. You know, I like the fact that it has like a giant mirror, but you know what, I, I lack luster, so gotta go. Uh, uh BoxyCharm, how, how boring is this? The packaging, adorable, very cute. Inside, boring. So we got, she gots to get out. Vice 4, I think, I mean, I used it a couple of times. Honestly, the thing is huge, like, I just, I'm never reaching for the, you gotta go. Okay, well, we've emptied one, more, so now some things can go back in that I like, and I will actually use. Okay, what's in the next one? Oh boy. Oh my gosh, there's another palette in here. You know what, I'm out. Did this make it back in from a declutter that I, I think it did. I think I got rid of it and then I put it back. It's, I, out. This thing, it's so old anyway. I mean, it's got to get out. Okay. Okay. Honestly, I've decluttered this and put this back in. Especially like this old one, this like Too Faced chocolate bar. This used to be my jam. Do I use this anymore? No. Just holding on to it for sentimental reasons. That's dumb. Gotta go. Also, her sister. Uh, semi-sweet. I, I, I did dig into this, like, uh, peanut butter color a lot. Uh, but you know what? I haven't touched this in Lord knows how long, so she's got to go. Also, here, here, I do these dumb things. Listen, I bought this Too Faced Chocolate Bonbons palette at Marshall's because it was like, you know, a deal. And it's cute, right? Ask me how many times I've used this since then. Maybe once. I don't, I'm not impressed. It's not that great. Look at it. It's very boring. I mean, if you, if you take away the fact that these are like heart-shaped pans, um, it's super boring, so she's got to go. Packaging's cute, though. I mean, you got to give it to Too Faced for making cutesy stuff, but I'm over it. The pa Wait, there's more palettes in here? What's this? Oh, this was like a BoxyCharm thing, but I haven't used it, so you got to go. Oh, Urban Decay Electric Palette. So fun. Never touch it. Gone. Okay, these, these two Becca palettes, I actually do touch. I've touched... This is like... Ugh, this is so old. It's probably gross, but I use it anyway. This is the, like a highlight palette. I'm blinding you guys with a mirror. Um, from maybe like... I don't know how many Christmases ago, but I still use it. It's got topaz in it. I've like hit pan on it, as you can see. Uh, I really, honestly, what I should do is go out and buy a full size of topaz, uh, but I will keep this anyway, even though it's really old. And maybe I will let go of the um, Ombre Rouge palette, which at the time when I purchased it was Fantasticals, and now I am not impressed. I have to put too much of this on to get 
the amount of color I'd like, so uh, it was fun while it lasted. Goodbye. Oh, we got lip stuff in here. I'm not gonna use this, 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 um, or this, or this, uh, I might use that. Let's see, Let's see what else. The rest of the stuff in here, it looks legit. All right, but this, this, this can, this stuff, this nonsense, like, listen, okay, I got dark skin. So this stuff looks good on some dark skin people, like this, this business, this, like, nude, nude business, but I, I can't pull this off, so she's, she's got to go. What's in this next one? Oh, it's skincare. I think the skincare is fine. This I've, I've been using. I just need to, like, use the masks and all that stuff, so she's fine. There's no makeup in here, which is fine. Okay. I can buy. Good. Oh, it's nail stuff. Hmm. I've done the nail polish declutter before, but, uh, let's do it again. I honestly haven't painted my nails in months because I'm lazy, not because I don't like the way they look. I'm just, I just can't do it. Okay. I'm just going to get rid of the blue, um, and kind of like the green, like the little, this neon green is kind of cute. I don't know. Um, some of these... I, I usually like these kinds of colors, like these, um, like dark kinds of colors. I usually don't go for like, actually, it's kind of a cute color. Okay, I'll keep that one. Um, but I'm going to get rid of, so let me just get rid of the one. Are these two like exactly the same? They're very similar. Okay, these are very similar. I'm going to get rid of the Colt Beauty one because it's very, it's just gray. Gray, gray, gray. This one has a little bit more brown and I kind of like that, so I'm gonna keep that one around and get rid of um, the straight up gray. Uh, let's see, this is, um, oh, oh, I got this in France. I got it at like Monop Beauty in, in Paris. And um, I, you know what, honestly, I've used this a bunch. So I guess I'll hold on to it a little bit longer even though it's like super old, uh, it's fine. So the rest of this stuff in here is, fine. So this is like fragrance and powder and it's gonna, it's fine. Okay. This is my eye drawer. Hmm. So honestly, oh, that's like a little face thing. So I do, do use this stuff because I'm in, I'm in a lot of, um, opera performances and I have all these like false lashes for like stage stuff. I don't actually wear false lashes like out in public that much. Um, because I, I don't know. I mean, I like the way that they look, but I don't, I just can't bring myself to do that like on a regular basis. It's just too much work, but on stage it's fine. So I'm going to keep the lashes. Actually, this is just the packaging. What am I doing? Um, can, can you not? Can you wait? I know you want to. Here, I'm, I'm a sucker. There you, there you go. Oh, not impressed. I can play with you later, I promise. Um, so all of this stuff in here, you know what, that's not true. Cause what's this? What, what is this? What, what it, how, what do you use this for? Is this a, a, like a brow thing? What, what is this? I never use this, it's out. Are we playing and decluttering? Is that what's happening? Cause it's, it's a hard thing to do. Here, here, here you go, go for it. Okay. Uh, let's see. This guy, I think I'll hold on to. Um, how how many how many eyeliner pencils does one need? Let's get rid of this. Um, this. And no, we'll keep the elf one because I like that one. So now I have one, two. Wow, we got this one too. All right, we'll keep. We'll get rid of these. So we'll hold on to um, an excessive amount of three, three eyeliner pencils, <laughs> as opposed to uh, seven, three. Three is better than seven. Look at them all. <sighs> I never need to buy mascara ever again. Um, mascara is fine. What is this? Is this eyeliner? Holy Toledo, I needed some eyeliner, new eyeliner. Heck yeah! 
See, I don't even know what's in here. That's the problem. That's the problem with having too much beauty stuff. It's insane. It, I mean, it's, it's, it's okay. This is fine. Calm down. Everything's fine. It's fine. Okay, bottom drawer is, <laughs> wow, I got earrings in here. That's a good place for that. Everything in here is helpful. Um, I got some extra brushes in here though. Look, look, new brand new brushes from Luxie Beauty. Let's open these and see if they're worth their salt. There's one shader, one small shader, and one small contouring. Contouring? Well, okay, I don't do contouring, because let's be real. But I do use these little brushes for like under my eyes and highlighter, so we're holding on to that. Uh, I can't put on eyeshadow with a brush this big. Look at it. My my eye shape and my lid space is like not this big. However, I, I, I would not be as big. You know what? I don't need this. It's got to go. Get, get out. Okay, this fan brush. Oh, Clover's here. Clover wants to help. He's <laughs> Clover wants to help. Clover wants to help. Okay, I got a fan. I got a fan brush. Uh, I don't think it's ever been unwrapped. It's got to go. <laughs> What's this? Oh, it's a stippling brush? I've used that. Oh, wow. Okay. So I think I'll just hold on to this, but just for sentimental value. I have, I have used it, but like back in the, back in the day, Bath and Body Works used to sell makeup. Maybe like the early 2000s, late 90s, Bath and Body Works sold makeup. And I have like two, like a makeup brush from Bath and Body Works here. Check it out. I don't know if you can see it, but it says Bath and Body Works. <laughs> the line was called uh, Beautiful by Nature because they used to like to pretend like they were like that cool natural, natural brand, but we all know that it's just dyes and synthetic fragrances, <laughs> which is fine, but like. You know, do you guys remember when Bath and Body Works had like this like barrels in their store and they were like gingham and crazy? Yeah, so that was, that was back in the day. So I, I'm gonna keep that. Um, and then the brush is like, what is this? What what is this? Like I want to know what is this? How do you use this? Is this like for what? It, like what is this? This is a foundation brush. How? What? Who are you putting foundation on with a doll? Like I, this is not a foundation brush. <laughs> Maybe, oh, it could be a good concealer. You know what, concealer brush, we're keeping that. Oh. Okay, so we got three brushes down here in the like the leftover brush area. So we got rid of all the other stuff. I got just rando Q-tips back here, which is fine. <laughs> so we're just gonna put this stuff in here, the skin stuff. Okay, I feel good about that. Let's move up to the main area here where I put my everyday or most used makeup. Okay, so I'm gonna do something with these Z palettes. I don't know. I feel like I could put some blushes in these, like maybe like, maybe the uh, Tarte blushes will fit in here. I don't know. I loved this palette, but they've changed the formula since then. This is the Anastasia uh, World Traveler palette, and I really like the packaging, and I love Anastasia formula. But I never use this palette anymore because they've changed the formula since they've made this and I've just, it's not impressive. And plus, the packaging, I, when I open it, it makes me insane. Listen, listen. You're up to the mic. I don't know about you guys, but I can't handle that, so she's gotta go out. Oh, what's this hiding back here? It's a cover FX. Oh, this is a BoxyCharm thing. Look, look at this thing. Do you think this would look good on my skin tone? I don't think so. Gone. Oh, Master by Mario. See, I had so much stuff. I didn't really, I didn't even realize this was back there. I love this palette. We're keeping her. Okay, and honestly, all most of what I use is Anastasia palettes. I'm like a big fan. Um, Self-made, I still use on occasion. So you know what, we're keeping the Anastasia palettes. They're awesome. I just gotta move everything up here so that I know what's there, there. Boom, that's, that's the move. This is a blush palette. Do I want this? No, I don't want this. Okay, I think everything up here is pretty good. What? What? Everything else up here is pretty good, except for what, why? Okay, a lip liner. You guys, this is from BoxyCharm. I never, ever, 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 ever use lip liner. Should I have this? Absolutely not, it's gotta go. This made it into a declutter pile and then it got put back in because I was like, oh, it's Becca. You know, like that whole thing you go through when you're like, when you're like, 
Oh, it's Be it's Becca, you know? It's the name. The name. Becca. I like Becca. Don't we all? But like I don't I don't use this. Okay? So it's got to go. I'll use powder over liquid any any day. <laughs> I've used all of that stuff. So let's go into the blushes. I honestly don't think much will happen here because your girl uses all the blushes. You know what? Except for this. This stupid, <laughs> this stupid uh, foreplay palette. This was NARS. Like, this is uh, Orgasm and like some other blushes and like a highlighter. Never use it. Gone. You use this Anastasia palette. Ooh, look at the packaging. I didn't, I didn't notice it had like the little pattern on it. Um, but I do use this. Got it at Marshall's. Love it. <laughs> Love this thing so. Um, and I use, you know what? Look at, look. Have I used these? No. It's gotta go. Someone's gonna love this though. <laughs> like, but I have never, I have not used this in a long time. I, I have too many blushes to be impressed by this. So the packaging is adorable and I'll have this video to remember it by, but I'm, if I'm being honest with myself, I don't use it. Also the packaging is huge. It's like, I mean, you could, you could slap someone with this. Okay, why is there powder in here? Why? What happened, Kay? The NARS blush palettes do get used, especially this one gets used a lot, but mostly, honestly, just because this color. Love it. Let's uh, just rearrange stuff in here a little bit. I've used almost everything in here and can stay. Um, all of these blush blushes get used, so. I heard that these just pop out of their packaging, these tart things. Either they're, the packaging's really cute, looks like macaroons. Um, but I wonder, if they could just go in here. You know, like honestly, like I, like honestly, that would be so much easier. Can I not just poke a hole in the packaging? Oh my God. Really? I thought these were just supposed to just pop out. <gasps> There's the hole. I was trying to go through this one, which is not a hole. What a ditz. This, oh. Saving measures. That's my favorite one of it. I don't think they make that one anymore. It's called um, Achote. Achote is the color on the back. Uh oh. <laughs> it's not. Why do they do that? It's a little bit ratchet, but that's fine. Yeah, this is my favorite blush. I use. I wear it all the time. It's called Achote, or is that what it's how it's pronounced anyway? Um, I'm gonna put that one in there. That was my fave. Yay! I mean. <laughs> I think, yes, this did take up more space than like it was already taken, but look, we've got our own like blush palette. That's so fun, and I use these. So we're gonna pop that right in the drawer there, and we're gonna recycle this packaging. So uh, that's happy, I guess. I have not touched this cream eyeliner in who knows how, look, look how much I used. Look, 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 look at the wasted money. Like I was so excited to use this, and then I was like, oh, use it once and it's definitely been it's just definitely been over a year so I'm gonna just chuck it I'm ugh. okay these things are old so I'm gonna open new mascaras because um, do I need to buy mascaras like the the answer is no but however I do have to say that I really like this mascara <laughs> like nine times out of ten I was using this mascara and I really liked it it's got a weird like thing going on with with the brush like I don't I I've never I've never used this feature I mean maybe I should try it but I've never I've never like I've never like done that you know but um, I do like the mascara it's got a nice brush look it's got it's like a soft spiky it's really cool formula is really great too but it's, it's definitely older than like I'd like to admit so uh, it's got to go and these this stuff is old too especially this liner um, but I have a new one that I didn't know about, so very exciting. So, uh, goodbye. goodbye. Uh, powder and face stuff. I do use this, like, for contouring. Um, and occasionally I use this, too. Because it's got a really red bronzer, which I kind of like if it's, like, wintertime. But, like, cool. Um, the rest of this stuff is pretty good in here. I use all this powder concealer business. Business. And you know what, though? Honestly, truthfully haven't used this bronzer in a long time. How do you even open this? Yeah, this, I, I haven't, it's got, it's gone. Okay, highlighters, oh, it's hard. Okay, <laughs> um, 
because I like that. You know what? Remember this from last time? Remember I said, oh, I was going to try it and use it. I haven't used it, so it's going now. The rest of this, oh, Color Effects Glitter Drops. Uh, I'm not going to use these. I'm like over 40, and honestly, I don't need, <laughs> not to say that you can't rock a glitter if you're a little bit older, honestly, but like, let's be real. Let's be, like, let's be honest, and I'm never, ever, ever going to use this, so it's going to go out the door. I have a loose highlighter. Is this, like, something I, that got put back into the collection? Summer Haze. Hmm. Well, brand new. I, I can't, I can't do a loose highlighter. I, I mess. This guy? This? Hmm. I've, no, gone. I've never used it. <laughs> the rest of this, though... The rest of this though, it's good, especially this. This is like, was like limited edition, this apricot, Bobbi Brown shimmer brick, we love her. Use it a lot. I actually like both of these shimmer bricks that I have. They're pretty handy and they're nice. So I use everything else. Wow, my collection has gone from a lot to kind of a few, which is cool. Like, this is all I've got left in here. I used to have a lot more, you guys. Like. It's very much pared down. Okay, now honestly, I've got some room in the back here for some palettes to hang out. So we're gonna put, pat. you know what? I like these um, highlighter palettes to hang out there because they're kind of large and charge. Like this guy too. So, boom, boom. I think it's because Pat, can Pat McGrath fit? Can she fit? Is she fitable? She's kind of thick. Thick. So honestly, this is what's left in the drawer, and I'm okay with that. <laughs> like, it's not very much at all. If anyone's wondering, this is the Helmer drawer unit from Ikea. It was very easy to put together. It's got wheels, um, and it's used for all my like excess beauty nonsense. So I like it. It's, it's nice. It's like metal. <laughs> it's nice quality, and it has these little slots for labels. Although all my labels came out, and um, I'm gonna have to redo them, but um, we like her. Oh my gosh, I'm done. It felt so good to get rid of all that stuff. Let me show you what's on the bed right now. All of this nonsense is leaving my house very soon. If it's brand new, um, I'm taking it to Dress for Success. If it's not, I am going to exchange it with my opera friends. They love some free makeups. Um, and I take these to the dressing rooms and they just go to town. So um, they're gonna be so excited to get some free makeup. Uh, so this is the stuff I'm getting rid of. I'm so excited and I'm canceling BoxyCharm because I cannot handle like five products in my mail every month. It's just insane. And uh, this was just the packaging from the the uh, blushes and this is just packaging from br the brushes. Brushes, blushes, brushes, blushes, blushes, brushes. And I don't know why I had a travel toothpaste in there. Don't ask, but um, I mean, I'm glad to have it. It's nice. Anyway, I'm gonna end this video now because uh, I'm running out of sunlight and my dog is also over it. He's left the room. He is done, he's done with me. Uh, I'm gonna put all this stuff in the bag and uh, sh just shuffle out the door, just be happy. So uh, let me know in a comment down below if you got caught up in the beauty craze of like 2013, 2014, and if you're like over it. Cause I know that like I'm kind of over it, but I still love makeup, but I'm just mainly over like having so much of it. Uh, right now, I just wanna have all of the houseplants. That's my new makeup, so. Houseplants are more fun right now. <laughs> so it's because they're alive and they're beautiful and I take care of them and they grow and it's just so rewarding. So makeup does not grow or change over time and if it does, I'll throw it in the trash. Anyway, I hope you guys are having a great morning, great evening, great afternoon, wherever you are. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Mm-hmm.